Hey guys, welcome back to Nino Kuni 2 Revenant Kingdom. In this episode, Roland's gonna look at his favorite flower, which is right over there. And also, I'm gonna get this Higgle stone, which I saw in editing. I was like, why did why? I was staring right at it? And uh, well met, Traveler. Show me what you got. Give me something I'd like. You know, mushrooms, sticky, slimy, and gunky ones. Okay. Uh, speed. The moon mushroom. No, it's the gunk shrooms. Right? I hope so. Oh, here you go. Hope you like it. Don't spend it all in one place. Wait, I didn't give him currency. I gave him food. Don't eat it all in one place. Spread it out. Oh, what the? It's a blue one. Hegel head inside came flying out. He also might have a fungal infection. I don't know what the crap's going on there, but hopefully it doesn't overtake his brain. That'd be bad. We haven't actually like messed with our uh, Higgledies in a minute. If that one still has the same cost as the... Yeah, there's no reason we shouldn't like diversify our elements a bit, so... He has Higgledy Splosh? All right, all right, I'm seeing, I'm seeing. It, it seems like he actually has the lowest attack out of them all, though. Maybe we should um replace it with the, no, that one has the heal. All right, we're gonna get rid of the uh, the wind attribute one for this water one, because chances are it'll come in handy. And yeah, now that we've taken care of that, it's time to go prove that Master Pugnacious is a cheating piece of crap, god dang. All right, Pugnacious, I'm back, and I'm ticked as crud. Also, who are you? Are you new here? Huh. I could have sworn that I warned you to exhibit the requisite degree of decorum. Luckily for you, Magnamitomy is one of His Excellency's many virtues. Okay, I, don't even, I can't even read a single word you just said, Dorcas. I don't give a don't. Wait, I want to destroy this. Can I? Can I? Can I? Well, once I take over your kingdom, Turfface, I will. Anyway, we got to talk, Pugnacious. Mm. Ah, you again. And did Lady Luck prove evidence of the dastardly machinations in which you imagined us guilty? Uh, Master Pugnacious, you've deceived Nile and your own people. The very people you're supposed to serve. Hmm? More wild accusations. And where is your proof? Hmm? Did you find evidence of trickery? Some ingenious device hidden somewhere inside Lady Luck, perhaps? Hmm, come on. You know we're on to you. Why not drop the act? Uh, there's no act to drop. I am innocent, as the mistress of fortune herself will attest. Well, she now, huh? That's uh, such a bad idea. I mean, she's the one who passed judgment on legal matters around here. How does a trial sound? <gasps> Crud, dude, a trial. Uh, it sounds like a very fine idea indeed. Mm, yes, this is the way of gold paw. All matters of state, be they legal, political, or otherwise, are decided by the rule of the sacred dice. And as rule of this great nation, I am more than willing to submit myself to the judgment of Lady Luck. But now. That if I am found innocent, I shall treat your attempts at sedation with the gravity they deserve. You will be punished for crimes against the state. Do you accept my terms? Yeah, why not? Mm. <laughs> we do! Okay, uh, then we will begin the preparations right away. Come to the square at the appointed time. Okay, what's the appointed time? Literally right now. Why, why did you, why'd you, why'd you say the appointed time? What else are we gonna do with it? Eh? All right. Anyway. All right. Time for the main event. Yep. I'll leave this to you. If you don't mind, Roland. Sure. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. Yeah, I don't know. Evan, Evan's not on the point where he could be like, And that's how he did it. Now I understand. Evan's too pure. Anyway. The preparations are complete. The trial can be underway as soon as you confirm that you are ready. Shall we begin? Yeah, let's get this class trial. I mean, this trial underway. <laughs> I am so stupid. But here we go. Let's uh have our showdown against Pugnacious. Look at him. He's not even looking at us. He knows he's guilty. He's, oh, he's just looking at his die thing. I hate that guy. I thought he was going to be cool. No, he's a turd. And again, his name is Pugnacious. Eh. I hereby convene the trial of fortune of Master Pugnacious, Grand High Roller of Gold Paw. Being the defendant, his eminence will be unable to preside over this hearing. As such, it falls to me to discharge his duties. I hope you'll forgive my doubtless clumsy efforts in this most unfamiliar role. Bro, relax. Everyone's got to start somewhere. A trial is underway. And with the Great High Ruler in duck, no less. Eh, yeah, what in the world could have happened? God dang, boy. Um, why are you dressed like that, Roy? <laughs> I saw this in a video game once. That's what, uh, because this is a court of law. Yeah, that's it. 
Also, I really like this suit. Huh. The Defendant Master Pugnacious, Grand High Ruler of Golpa, bows his head before Lady Luck and submits to her judgment in this matter. This is a really stupid way to have a trial. He stands accused of dereliction of duty, specifically the knowing deception of his people. Yeah. Kind of a turd move. Do you really have to make the taxes that big? Now the prosecution would like to begin by making its cause. Yeah, yeah, I'm on it. I intend to prove this court that Master Pugnacious did knowingly and willingly, with the aid of a network of his most trusted retainers, defraud the very people who, whose care he is entrusted. No further, I will show that he distributed devices among his accomplices which were used to carry out deception on a grand scale through the manipulation of dice rolls. Yeah. I do not doubt that you have found evidence of some trifling chicanery among low-level officials, but to allege that this administration as a whole is complicated in such behavior is preposterous, is it now? I do not, have not, and will never engage in dishonest practices of any kind. And to accuse me of such is to defame my character and call my good name into question. God, just, just plead guilty, are you peace? Perhaps you'll permit those present to withhold judgment on the matter of your innocence until I've presented my proof. Oh, crook, get him rolling. Tear him up! Here it is! This piece of paper I found. Hey! Ugh. But what is the meaning of this? Oh, we got him. I think you know very well. After all, this document was written by you. Was it not? Oh my gosh. Ladies and gentlemen of the court, I present this prosecution key exhibit. Written instructions for the assembly of manipulable dice. Clearly signed by Master Pugnacious. Hm. Dramatic zoom! Does the accused have anything to say in his defense? No. Only that my prior outburst was merely an expression of shock at the brazenness of this shameless act. I have never seen this document in my life. To stoop to the fabrication of evidence is a pitiful tactic indeed. That's a lie. You just saw this right now. So you have seen this document in your life. S suck turds. Is it forgery? Plain and simple. But it ain't the- Why don't we have Lady Luck be the judge of that? Oh yeah, perfect. By all means. Oh crud, this is getting good. It seems both sides are satisfied to entrust judgment of this matter to the mistress of fortune. May the die roll stand as the undisputed word of truth. Lady Luck, grant us an even number of this evidence to be false. If it be otherwise, let the number be odd. Time to show the people of Golpar just how badly they've been misled. You go, Roland. Oh my god, he's so sick and cool. Uh, I love this game. Even the evidence is judged to be false. Lady Luck has spoken. Right to your majesty. Ha! What is happening? The die. Something is wrong with the die. Which brings us to the crux of the prosecution's case. That Master Pugnacious knowingly manipulated Lady Luck. Whoa! No! We got him. Heck yeah! Like, you could've just, I don't know. What? Not let us do that. Like, you could've just let the dice roll one time and be like, oh! Pugnacious is an idiot, anyway. But this is... Yeah. It's the end of the line. By the use of the remote control, the outcome of Lady Luck's die rolls can be readily manipulated. Hmm. The prosecution was able to visit a place where these devices are manufactured and to procure one of its own purpose, namely, the demonstration of this fraud. Master Pugnacious deliberately kept the taxes high and stole Niles Forest from him, and all using this horrible trick. Master Pugnacious? Uh, you have anything to say? Can this really be true? Mm, cheater! Deceiver! Shame on you, you are the Grand High Roller! 
Don't you have anything to say for yourself? Like, seriously, speak up, Dorcas. Wait, what? No, don't go Super Saiyan. Like, what? what? Um. Oh, well, that I did. <laughs> I did for Goldpaw. Ah! I had to make my nation rich, richer than any other. It was the only way. Are you sure about that? Uh, the bond with his people is weakening. Soon, it will be time. Huh? What's that? It's the Kingmaker, Longfang! He doesn't look happy. Oh, Longfang? Here in the city? But why? Master Pugnacious, huh? your right to rule has been tested and found wanting. My plan is complete. Your king's bond is mine! <laughs> Crap, all right, this is getting good, uh, where are we? I don't know, but that snake dude look cool. It's an interdimensional dimension, ain't it? And if we don't do something, it leads up the whole kingdom. What? Then we have to stop Longfang. You ain't wrong there. You're not wrong there, my boy. Come on, let's knock some sense in this old bitey, shall we? Uh, it's pretty big, man. You just surely. That there ain't just a kingmaker. There's a kingmaker gondole. Blessed realm wrecker. Uh, does this happen often? Uh, don't be like that, man. Where there's a will, there's a way. His horse is marbles, ain't it? Which means you can't keep a lid on all that power. And what happens to power you can't keep a lid on? That's right, it comes flying out of you. Uh, are you, what? What? And the places where it comes flying out are exactly the right places to wall up. Hit them where it hurts and you'll hurt them good and proper. All right, I like it. Oh, and don't worry about nothing. Their special spots are. Thanks to your bond with yours, truly, you'll be able to spot them no problem. Oh, right, well, that, that's good to know. Okay. Oh my god. Level 24, crud, I'm not prepared. Remarkers are kingmakers who've lost control of their enormous power and run wild as a result. Points in which their energy escapes are particularly vulnerable to attack. So if you focus your assault on them, you'll do more damage. Got it. Holy crud. This is what I'm talking about. Holy. Oh my gosh, I should not waste all my mana though. Alright, let's um charge this up. Get the water spells flying. That did no damage. We're so screwed. Ah! Okay. Wait, we have water higgledies now. Crud, crud, crud. Okay. No, that's the uh, other guys. Okay. Uh, Higmakers. Higmakers are mysterious entities that absorb the power of kingmakers. Given the ability to exploit their weakness, when enough of them are gathered, they're born in items which kingmakers install in its power. So they can give us higgledies to fight bat? What the? Okay. So we gotta destroy these stones. That's what it sounds like. Yeah. Yeah, there's a couple. We just need a little more. Come on. Shoot that one magic. Oh, yeah. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, my gosh. And now we're doing the damage. Okay. Uh, let's get this uh, Higgledy going. Hopefully, they can focus down that weak spot. Oh, my gosh. This is so goddamn cool. Oh, my God. <laughs> this is all I wanted from the native code. Okay. This is... uh, We got to do that. Maybe... Oh, crap. All right. Not doing that much damage, but I guess we can't just sit there. Let's paw forever. Let's uh, do that. And yes! Big damage. Okay. Sweet. So far, so good. Oh, snap. We can hit the head. Let's get in those air combos. Wait. What are these guys doing? Can I use you yet? No, I don't have enough, I don't think. Come on. Everyone just... Pound his... Why are you not hitting the head? Let's do that attack. Oh, I wasn't zinged yet, though. It's a big mistake. Uh, let's try water spell. Yeah, okay. That is a good chunk. Oh my gosh, he's half... He's half done already. Oh my gosh. This is intense, but I don't think the boss fight's gonna be that easy, dude. Uh, yeah, I kind of saw that coming. Um... Let's go back to this sword. Oh, let's use these water ones. Why not? Help me out, bros! Do something! 
I don't know what you can do. Okay, they have a water cannon. That's awesome. Eh. Okay. Gotta swap my sword back. Did they shoot it yet? Yeah, they did. Okay. Holy crud. This is intense, but... Ugh. Okay, we're not taking that much damage yet, but that could change in a minute. Um, we need the more. We need more of the fire dudes. Oh crap! Here we go. What's it going for? Uh, what's happening? I can't put the camera. Well, how do we even get here? Do they ever explain that? Oh, let's just use this, I guess. I'm gonna assume these things are gonna explode unless we're uh taking them down instantly. So let's do that right now, I guess. Uh, come on. Okay. Luckily, they get knocked out in like one hit. What's it doing now? Ah, oh, dang it. Okay. God, this is actually... He's not doing a ton of damage, but still, like... It's rough. Wait, where are you guys going? Crud, I need your help! What the... Okay, I guess they're going over there now. Uh... How do we use them? Maybe I'm just not understanding properly. Wait, there it is. That's our opening. What are, you, what, are you, what are you guys doing? Crap. I was not paying attention. Oh, crud, we lost some of the... Are we gonna run out of battlefield? Crud. Is now our chance? Oh, now it is. Okay. Here you go. Get him, bro! Oh. It, it blocks! Okay, that's perfect. Oh my gosh. Alright, um... I don't know why I was shooting in that direction. Crud. Uh... It looks like it's a shield. So this is like a mechanic that, like, is used exclusively for the boss fights. I guess. Uh... Let's just charge this up. Oh, man. Oh, those stinking fireballs. Oh, yeah! It completely blocks it! Awesome. Oh my gosh. That's so cool. Alright. Now I see, so if we don't destroy the rocks, it does that attack. Oh my god. That, that does, like, specs of damage. Crud. Oh my gosh, this looks like seriously amazing. Like, I, I'd always have dreams of making a game like this, and now it actually exists. Just this giant boss battle. Oh my god. Uh, uh, I guess he's doing that again, son of a gun. Let's uh do some of that. I, uh, we don't have a way to charge up our magic, though. Oh no, no. These uh, things drop the magic orbs. Okay, sweet. Let's tear them apart. Alright. Well, not by much, though. Oh my gosh. I almost. Oh my god. Roland took a ton. Crud. Alright. Now it's coming back uh, in range, though, so. Now we understand what those uh, Kingmaker Higgledies do. Let's, uh, oh, crow, that one's already destroyed. Now it's getting tough, okay. Let's draw the way, still got hit, god dang it. Oh, well, what are you gonna do? Wait, that one's active again, all right. Oh my gosh, crud. He's not staying in range for very long at all. Here comes this attack again, oh my god! It has very lovely hair, I must say. All right, let's uh, make this again. Hopefully the barrier will come in time. Uh, I don't wanna die. Uh, everyone get in the circle. Tani, wh what? Why is Roland and Tani exclusively not inside the circle? What benefit does that have? I have no idea. All right. Crud. Might as well just charge up some magic. Against the boss. Uh, crud. I really don't want to lose this. No. What? Like two of those hit. God dang it. All right. We're good now, though. If we destroy that, and yeah. His uh, hands are back. Crud. Ah, uh, dang it. Has a lot of range. Let's uh, just try and focus and hit this one first. We got to get his head down again. Yeah, his defenses are so high. God dang it. All right. Roll out of the way, roll out of the way. Good thing we have the, uh, damage shield, but, like, it's not a use if, like, he's right on top of us. God dang it. Okay, actually, never mind. I take back every word I just said. Let's, uh... Is he doing it again? <laughs> I thought he was shooting the laser beam out. <laughs> Roland's just like, I don't care if it's custom or not, I'm shooting him with my guns. Alright. Destroy these, I don't want to deal with them. The water cannon dudes, oh my gosh, I'm so happy I found that Higgle Stone. Oh my god. Okay. Ah, oh, crud. Let's get some air combos going. I need to start using that attack again. Crud. I want to see if I can get through this without healing. So far, we're doing fine, but... Uh, come on, just a little bit more! No! Crap. Johnny could just use the heal button. I know, but... I want to see if I can do it. Uh, Alright, shield us again, please. We really could use it. Oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap! I don't know why I shot magic to evade uh, di damage, but hey. We living. I ain't complaining. Crud. Okay. Definitely don't want the fire sword here. Oh my god. Just knocked out Roland. God dang it. Uh, We'll be okay. We'll be okay. I don't know how many, like, how rare healing items are, so... I don't want to use them. Unless I absolutely have to. Ah! Come on, just a little bit more. Oh crap. Come on. It's gonna have to do it. Come on. Yes, he's down. A little bit more. And it's over. Holy crud. Not a super complicated boss fight, but god dang, was that hype. Oh, oh my gosh. And I feel like that's just the tip of the iceberg. Dang, man. Lofty, why don't you Why don't you look like that? What the dumb? Like, the thing's giant. Like, maybe he's a baby. I don't know. Well, I guess that kingdom's uh, dead, because their they're kingmaker's kind of destroyed. Like, what's going to happen now? So where'd everyone go? What the... Wh 
It's the, here's the square, ain't it? Uh, yeah, but things kind of... Yeah, we're back. What the heck? Um... Alright, then that takes care of that. I suppose that means Longfang has calmed down. For now, at least. I guess we better tie up with some loose ends, huh? Y yeah, like... Why did your, like, retainers think and steal your heart? Or not your heart, your bond, or whatever. And I have done the unforgivable. My desire to lift my kingdom out of poverty because of all-consuming greed. That weakness made me vulnerable, and he exploited it. Uh, who was he? The one who stole your king's bond? He came to see me months ago. He promised secret knowledge, knowledge of ways in which our nation might be made yet greater. And in return, he sought high office. It was he who suggested that the dice be manipulated, who gave me the means by which it might be done. You mean the technology? What? When did I fall under his spell? And how? How could I have allowed such a thing to happen? Crud. You managed to calm your kingmaker down. Without your king spawn, will you, uh, will things be okay? Uh, you have bought us a little time. He will sleep a while yet. Mm. But in time, he will reawaken. And in the absence of the bond, he will seek to destroy our kingdom once again. But why? Curse is scaly paid. It's a just a frame of reason to want a savagery. Not now. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll behave. Master Pugnacious, for the sake of your kingdom, for the sake of your bond, will you help us? Forgive me if I haven't introduced myself properly. I am Evan Pennywhisk of the House of Tildrum. I formed a pact with the Kingmaker of the Cradle of Light. I mean to find a new nation in the Hotlands. Will you stand with me? Uh, so, that is why I sensed in you. It was plain to me from the first that you were no ordinary child. But what is it that you propose? I want to protect our world. I want to make sure that nobody else has to lose what's important to them. And I want you to help me. Dang. I will do all that I can, of course. Wait, really? I fear that he who stole my king's bond may not be satisfied with mine alone. This being so, we must stand together with our brother nations, or lose all that it means dear to us. With this in mind, I will return Niles Force to him. Indeed. I mean to return all that I stole. Heck yeah, man. Character development! Oh my god! Word of my decision has been sent to Nile already, of course. Thank you. Thank you so much, Master Pugnacious. <sighs> Gold Paw will rise again, and it's people with it. I wish you good fortune in your quest, friends. You could, could you not talk about luck and fortune for like two seconds? All right. But well, that <laughs> crud, yo, that just worked out for everybody. God dang, even Nile. Also, Gold Paw isn't destroyed. I like it, but uh, I guess our quest sort of isn't done yet. Dang, this is a long chapter, yo. Holy crud. I guess the next thing we better do is go tell Nile that, yeah, his, uh, he got his crap back. Hey, man, what up? Yeah, beauties, yeah. Yeah, body, body, we beauties. You're getting weird, Nile. I got my force buck. And it's all thanks to yourselves. You can have all the trees you want. Knock yourselves out. Thank you. Thank you so very much. Wait, if he taught us the ability to grow more trees, does that mean you could just make more? What? Now we can finally start building our kingdom. Yeah! That's my heck of a side glass. <laughs> Wait, Niall. Pugnacious and his king's bond stolen by a creepy, snaked, masked, weirdo, idiot, moron. Okay, we're getting a strategy destroy. <laughs> you wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Jinx. Stolen jigs! His kingmaker must be tearing the place to pieces! Uh, nah, we took care of that. Ah, uh, he had once or two shut enough. Once we talked it a little less, it won't forget. Good repose safe for now. Hmm. King's one stealing's no mean feat, though. Hmm. He didn't happen to f infuse things with an awful filthy fug, D. But, um, yes. A sort of purple aura. Hmm. That'll be the horned ones doing then. Right enough. Ah, the horned one? 
Yeah, there's gotta be a lot of horned ones in this kingdom, right? The old kingdom, a place called Allegoria. A nasty piece of work, and no mistake. For someone to be using the beast's power would have to mean. Aye. I cannot see it being anyone but Doloran. He was the king that shared a bond with the creature. Uh -huh. Wh what? So we just need to go to this Allegoria place and get the bond back, right? Mm, you have a job doing that, I'm afraid. Allegoria hasn't existed for oh, 2,000 or more years now. It disappeared along with the land in which it stood. The crud? So he's the king of a country which hasn't existed for centuries? What does that mean? Is he a ghost or something? <laughs> Maybe. What if I? Whatever he is. I'd say he's looking to pinch people's king's bonds in order to try and bring the horn one back somehow. And then if he does that, the whole world be filled with purple fug. Before you can say we're doomed. So Pugnacious was right. I'll be trying to steal more King's Bonds. Well, that's not good. We'll lose Lofty, man! <laughs> Are you looking at me like that for Mun? <laughs> Don't worry, we'll protect you. Then we must let him succeed. We can't let him bring back the Horned One. Mm, we sure can. But we're going to stop him. We'll need to strengthen our entire kingdom. A kingdom we haven't even started building yet. Uh, good point. Let's get to work, shall we? Yeah. Aye. Time to get building, me hearties. I'm cool with that. Crud. But man, there's a lot going on. Like, <laughs> crud. Game's already starting to like hit us with a heavy plot. I like that. Aye, sounds like a plan, right enough. I best come with you. You'll be needing my help. But really? What? Are you gonna join our like cause? Speaking of which, things be getting underway by now. I reckon. Wait, what? Y you already got us our lumber? That'd be pretty sick, dude, I'm not gonna lie, cause I, uh, I mean, me and Batsu can only cut so much wood, like, it'll take forever. Look. Ah, uh, it smells a smell on the wind, not a progress. Seems the Meiji dolls got tired of twiddling their thumbs. Heck <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Where did all these people come from? I see sky pirates, greenlings, even a few people from Ding Dong Dell. Wait, was it the dude we told them to get? They must all want to be citizens of our amazing new kingdom. God dang. That they must, right enough. What how the swabs even know to come a-knockin'? Guess maybe we'll... word got around? Yeah, thank me for that, son. I didn't expect so to turn up so soon, to be honest. Oh, Niall, you... <laughs> God dang it. I put word on the street, you king. Man, I guess we're really getting started then. A wee thank you for getting the old forest back, like... Hmm. That's more than we could have ever hoped for. Crud. Oh, think nothing of it. I was only the teensy ween used to favors in return. That you make me your minister of finance. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. There's none can pitch a penny like I can. Uh, that's quite the res. Yeah, why not? I think that sounds like a wonderful idea. Hmm. So if now is the minister of finance, I guess it makes Batu the minister of defense. Oh, awesome. <laughs> the swab in charge of fighting, you mean? <laughs> I like the sound of that. A good deal, ha! Uh, yeah, I, I appreciate the enthusiasm. I guess I can be your advisor. I have a little experience running a country. I'm sure I can help you out here and there. Hmm. N no. You'll be my chief consul. I'm no politician, Roland. I shall need your help. Well, that's very kind of you, Evan. I just... I don't know if I'll be... What? You're doubting yourself? It's the king's job to appoint his ministers, correct? Then I hereby appoint you chief counsel. Hmm. <laughs> well, alright then. Chief counsel it is. By royal appointment. Dang. What's Tani gonna do then? <laughs> She's like butts in. The queen, obviously. <laughs> no problem. Happy to see you're finally taking the lead. I suppose I am, aren't I? I'm still not sure if I'll be able to up to the job, but I have to try. And thanks to all of you, I finally feel ready to. I'll try my best, for your sakes and for mine. Dang it. Flippin' mon, I almost forgot! Eh? If I've been a kingdom, we need a proper tidy name, ain't it? Make things official-like. Uh... <laughs> 
been doing some thinking about that. I've decided to call our kingdom... Evermore. Well, what do you think? Evidence to God, thank you! Evermore, huh? I like it. Did you come up with it yourself? Mm, oh no, it's from an ancient story. The story of a great kingdom whose people were so happy, they wished it was last forever. Hmm, fitting. Yeah, it really is. All right, Mr. King. You name your country, time to address your adoring citizens. Yeah, I guess that's up next. Yeah! <laughs> what, what? Um, sorry, I don't speak pirate about to. <laughs> well, I guess it's speech time. Oi! Listen up, ye magey curs! King Evans got a rousing speech for ya! Pay attention! Huh? Hmm. Thank you all! Building our new kingdom won't be easy. But we will build it! A beautiful, bountiful kingdom! Where everyone can live happily ever after! Wow. I want you all to join me on this journey! The road ahead may be a long one, but at the end of it, there is hope! <laughs> There's King Liwa. That wasn't half bad. <laughs> nice speech, Evan. Couldn't have done better myself. This is where it all begins. Here and now, our kingdom. We're with you to the bitter end, lad. Come hell or high water. Thank you, all of you. So the people who had heeded Neil's call and flocked to the heartlands set about building their new nation. And Evermore took its first faltering steps on the road to becoming a kingdom. A kingdom where everyone could live happily ever after. Just as Aranella had wished. Or so they hoped. Someone with a brand new kingdom, you don't look very happy. Uh, I am happy, but I'm worried. There's still so much we don't know. And now there's a force bent on destroying our whole world. How can I ever hope to overcome something like that? You can't, on your own. But you're not on your own, are you? No, not anymore. I have friends beside me. The best friends I could ever hope for. That's right. So turn to them when you need to, and take it one step at a time. You'll get there in the end. I suppose so. I can only do my best after all. <laughs> exactly. And your best is only going to get better. I'll see you again soon, Evan. Yes. See you soon.